A camel is an even-toed ungulate in the genus Camelus that bears distinctive fatty deposits known as humps on its back. Camels have long been domesticated and, as livestock, they provide food like milk and meat and textiles like fiber and felt from hair. Camels are working animals especially suited to their desert habitat and are a vital means of transport for passengers and cargo. Hello and welcome to KYC News. Please don't forge to subscribe and hit the bell icon. There are three surviving species of camel. The one hump dromedary makes up 94% of the world's camel population and the two hump Bactrian camel makes up 6%. The wild Bactrian camel is a separate species and is now critically endangered. Even when it is dungulated in, a camel the kind of camelus that displays distinct fat deposits referred to as humps on its domestication of camels dates back a long time. In addition, they serve as livestock and people have kept camels for textiles. Over 4,000 years and still rely on their worldwide survival depends on them each year. Spana assists thousands of camels. Each year by way of our activities in Jordan, Tunisia, India, Continue reading to learn more information to know about camels and find out what makes them so special more domesticated camels were kept as pets. More than 3,000 years ago and currently they provide transportation for people. They can easily move across dry areas transport an additional 200 kilograms 90 pounds while undertaking a 20 mile 32 kilometer stroll the blistering desert day. Camels can traveling as quickly as horses, but also pristine legendary epics without camel use by humans for food or water for their leather, flesh, and wool even carried out that might be utilized to fuel the dromedary camel. Often called the Arabian today, the camel is only used as about 90% of the animals attained. Geometries are the camels of the earth. There are two varieties of wild Bactrian camels. Wild Bactrian camels that have been tamed are a lot more trim, with fewer humps and more domesticated Bactrian camels have less hair. The camel of dromedary has one hump, and what are the two Bactrian camels? Think of the simplest approach to recall the names. A large capital D laying on its side with a single hump D signifies dromedary, consider the nation's capital. B upside down with two bumps in the P, but what's in those homes for Bactrian rather than storing water? The fat turns a camel's source of energy. The two hump camel is called Bactrinus. Laying down on grass are a factory and camels. They store two humps like a on its back. One or two humpbacks of fat, not water dromedary camel has a single hump. What are the two Bactrian camels? Think of the simplest approach to recall the names. A large capital D laying on its side with only one hump D represents dromedary, consider the nation's capital. B upside down with two humps B, but what's in those homes for Bactrian rather than storing water? The fat turns a source of power for the camel pull camel in the Sahara Desert's middle-aged domesticated camels are dromedary camels. However, they continue to spew when the how long a camel can go without water climate has an impact on this stored energy. Considering its levels of activity, as well as the depending on the quantity, hump can fluctuate. When food is available, the camel consumes the body of the camel seldom ever uses fats accumulated in the hump, which cause the hump to squat down and slump a camel can move. Without water for a week or longer, and it can go without nourishment for several months. A 40% weight decrease followed by up to 32 gallons of liquid. One drinking contains 145 liters of water native to the Session bacteria, Camel's Chinese Gobi Desert, and the Bactrian Mongolian steppes develop a shaggy coat in the winter for defense against the frigid temperatures. Removing the outerwear while these camels can withstand the sweltering summer temperature variations from minus 29 degrees below 20 degrees Fahrenheit to 120 degrees Fahrenheit in Celsius, 49 degrees Celsius, camels sleep throughout the day and eating throughout the day. They are highly able to find food in a difficult environment. Each part of the ecosystem is a desert divided upper lip moves separately as a result. Camels are able to approach the ground for consuming these challenging but flexible lips can separate and sever. Vegetation like salty or thorny fish and even plants are consumed by camels. Ruminants such as cows regurgitate. 
Food spilled back into their stomachs to when they do that smelly thing, chew it again. Additionally, gases emerge, resulting in some pretty strong breath in a good manner one by blowing, a camel may form another is. Varied locations of the face, the head, neck, ears, and tail are all distinct significance for camels in society example. Erecting the ears suggests alertness. A warning indicator is the tail folded over the back. Of submission just before she delivers birth, a pregnant woman eliminates and separates herself from the herd quiet, lushly vegetated area for following a 12-week gestation, her cutting spot until the age of 14 months, a newborn camel can walk with the mother in less a minute. The calf features little bumps instead of humps. Peaks of hide, each with a tassel at the top hair is curled to show where the mother and child will develop humps. Returned in about two weeks to the herd nursing the foot then to 18 camel coughs depending on whether or not it is a dromedary or bactrian camel and to their inability to access food availability till around eight to seven ships of full adult size more domestication was done to the desert camels more than 3,000 years ago and currently they provide transportation for people throughout all avid contexts they can transport an additional 200 kilograms 90 pounds while undertaking a 20 mile 32 kilometer stroll the blistering desert day camels can traveling as quickly as horses but also endure unfathomable lengths of time without camel use by humans for food or water for their leather flesh and wool even carried out that can be utilized as fuel a camel with two humps camelus bactrianus taking a break on grass bactrian camels they have two bee like humps on their backs one or two humps of fat not water dromedary camel has a single hump what are the two bactrian camels think of the simplest approach to recall the names a large capital d laying on its side with only one hump d represents dromedary consider the nation's capital b upside down with two humps b only once in those humps for bactrian rather than storing water the fat turns a source of energy for the extreme camel native camels and a living factory china's kobe desert and the bactrian mongolian steppes develop a shaggy coat in the winter for defense against the frigid temperatures removing the outerwear while these camels can withstand the sweltering summer temperature variations from minus 29 degrees below 20 degrees fahrenheit to 120 degrees Fahrenheit and Celsius, 49 the Celsius scale the presence of domesticated dromedary camels in entire North African desert regions and the feral population of the Middle East is home to dromedary camels in Australia. In the 19th century, camels were brought as pack animals and were employed to traverse through the huge desert regions sociable camels coexist in herds with a male adult with dominance who is being driven from the group form bachelor herds make a variety of noises featuring groaning sounds moans and high bellows and rumbling are loud and pitched bleats mothers roar and their infants hum to each other in a cordial manner one camel may a way to greet someone is to blow on their face different postures for the head neck and ears and tail have several connotations in camel society for instance as ears advancing suggests alertness the tail coiled across the back indicates submission of a new camel for bondrometry standing next to her seated mother extends her neck to give her a sniff mother of a new bondrometry camel observe the lone hump like a teacup on its when she's about to back baby humps give birth a pregnant woman takes out and separates herself from the herd quiet lushly vegetated area for following a 12-week gestation her cutting spot until the age of 14 months a newborn camel can walk with the mother in less a minute the calf features little bumps instead of humps peaks of concealment each crowned with a castle wavy hair to show where the humps are there are two varieties of camels that will form two dromedary or one humped camels bactrian camels have three humps two rows and sets of eyelids lashes to prevent sand from getting in their eyes camels broad lips allow them to hunt for prickly plants and other creatures cannot eat camels and can shut because of the sandstorms the noses of to their chests thick skin pads and camels knees can fit easily and vary their humps allowed them to store hot sand 80 pounds of fat they can still live off for several weeks if not months when a camel eventually succeeds in finding water camels can consume up to 40 gallons at once are highly robust and capable of 900 pounds 
Camels can travel 25 miles per day on pounds. Travel at speeds of up to 40 miles per hour the like a racehorse, a camel cannot be created. Those who are irate may spit as a diversion. Whatever they perceive to be a threat, mom coughs from camels can last up to 14 months. Several coughs are born prior to giving birth. Absolutely white and gradually become brown, there are more than 160 adult coats available. Arabic terms for camel. Thank you for watching.